9 and the downtown and marketplace garages will be open too. Now, if you drive around, you'll probably notice a bunch of out of state license plates wherever you are. Visitors from all over the U.S. are settling into their spots to watch tomorrow's big show in the sky. ABC 22 Sky Tracker meteorologist Haley Boulay wanted to know where people at the Burlington waterfront today had come from. Hundreds of thousands are flocking to Vermont to witness the solar spectacle of a lifetime. Burlington was abuzz with people Sunday walking around to scope out where they're planning to watch the eclipse. Where are you guys planning on watching the eclipse? Uh, we haven't decided yet. We know there's a few spots around Burlington that uh, are being set up for the public, so that's actually the walking tour we're on right now, looking at the spots, seeing if we like any of them. Louis Perna is here from Boston. He was in the path of totality during the 2017 eclipse, and this time he wanted his wife to experience it. Being in the path of totality is wholly different from anything else, and so I'm excited for this one. Most have come early, making the trip up on Saturday and not hitting a lot of traffic. It took us only about five hours. We were surprised there wasn't an awful lot of traffic on the road. We Yet. thought maybe you know, <laughs> it would be really crowded. It wasn't. It was just a lovely drive. And everyone we spoke to said our area is the place to be. This is just going to be the perfect place to be. And look at this weather. Look at the crowds. It's going to be magnificent. And they're right. Our area could be looking at some of the best eclipse viewing conditions across the country at a time when that isn't typically the case. In Burlington, Haley Boulay, ABC 22 News.